NASA's James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has made a monumental breakthrough in the search for extraterrestrial life, confirming the presence of biosignatures on Proxima b, an exoplanet that has captured the attention of scientists for years. The discovery challenges previous assumptions that the planet, despite its location in the Goldilocks zone, the region where conditions might support liquid water, was incapable of supporting life due to its exposure to intense radiation from its host star, Proxima Centauri. For a long time, researchers believed that Proxima b's proximity to its volatile star would strip away its atmosphere and render it inhospitable, preventing complex life from forming. However, JWST's advanced infrared technology has provided new evidence that could change the course of our understanding of life beyond Earth. Proxima b, which orbits Proxima Centauri just 4.25 light-years away, is about the same size as Earth and sits within the habitable zone of its star. This made the planet one of the most intriguing candidates for the search for alien life when it was discovered six years ago. In theory, its position in the Goldilocks zone suggests that it could have the right conditions for liquid water, a vital ingredient for life as we know it. However, previous research raised doubts about its habitability. Proxima Centauri, a red dwarf star, is known for its frequent and intense stellar flares, which emit harmful radiation. This radiation could strip away any atmosphere Proxima b might have, making the surface inhospitable and preventing water from staying in liquid form. Earlier this year, NASA scientists announced that the planet's exposure to such radiation likely made it impossible for Proxima b to support life. The idea was that the radiation would erode the planet's atmosphere, leaving it dry and barren. This conclusion dealt a heavy blow to the dream of discovering extraterrestrial life on Proxima b. But thanks to the JWST's groundbreaking observations, this narrative has now shifted. The telescope's powerful instruments detected oxygen, methane, and carbon dioxide in Proxima b's atmosphere, gases that, when found together in the right amounts, are commonly associated with biological processes. On Earth, these gases are produced primarily by living organisms, which raises the exciting possibility that life could exist on Proxima b after all. The detection of these biosignatures presents a fascinating puzzle. How could life survive on a planet subjected to such extreme radiation? As Professor Brian Cox often points out in his explorations of the cosmos, life may not always resemble what we know on Earth. Life on Proxima b could exist in forms vastly different from what we're familiar with, perhaps in environments shielded from radiation. For instance, life might be thriving deep underground, protected from harmful solar radiation, or in niches where the radiation's effects are less severe. It's also possible that Proxima b's life forms have evolved unique biological mechanisms to withstand such harsh conditions, demonstrating that life may be far more adaptable and resilient than we typically imagine. This discovery significantly changes our approach to the search for life on other planets. It suggests that life might exist in environments previously considered too extreme, expanding the possibilities for where and how life can thrive. The results from JWST also reinforce Brian Cox's broader message that we are still in the early stages of understanding the vast and complex nature of life in the universe. If you enjoyed this exciting discovery, please press the like button. It really helps support the channel and motivates us to bring you more amazing content. Thank you for watching and I wish you all the best in life. May your journey be filled with curiosity, growth and endless possibilities. Take care and keep dreaming big.